hello guys welcome and welcome back to the kiss kitchen today i'll be showing you how to make rice mixed with tuna fish if you haven't subscribed to my channel please please kindly do so you don't get to miss any of my videos each and every week then stay tuned and enjoy my recipe on today's ingredients you're going to need two tablespoons of tomato paste one and a half tablespoon of garam masala a half a teaspoon of black paper, a half a teaspoon of turmeric powder, one teaspoon of curry powder, three large sliced onions, two grated carrots, three large tomatoes cut into small cubes, 350 grams of tuna fish or any fish that you like, salt to taste, and lastly, one and a half lime. In a medium small pot, start by adding the tuna. Make sure the tuna is completely dry. Then you're going to add the spices which are garam masala, black pepper, turmeric powder and curry powder. Then sprinkle a bit of salt to taste and squeeze one lime and mix everything well. Then cover to let the tuna to cook until completely dry. Once you get to see the tuna fish is starting to become dry, open the lid and give a quick mix to make sure that the tuna fish is completely dry like this and your tuna fish is ready and remove it from the fire and place aside. Then afterwards, we're going to cook the tuna fish in some tomato sauce. In a pan, add 3 tablespoons of oil and let it heat up. Once the oil is hot, add 2 tablespoons of ginger garlic paste, sorry I didn't mention these ingredients, and add the tomatoes and a bit of salt, and give a quick mix, and let it cook till the tomatoes are soft. Once the tomatoes are completely soft like this, add 2 tablespoons of tomato paste and give a quick mix. Then squeeze a half a lime and continue stirring and let it cook for at least 2 minutes. When the stew is thick like this, add the cooked tuna and mix everything well and let it cook for another 2-3 to three minutes. When your tuna is well combined and well cooked like this, then your tuna is ready and remove it from the fire and place aside. Then afterwards, we are going to fry our onions. On another pan, add some oil and let the oil heat up. Once the oil is hot, add the onions and cook the onions till golden brown. Once the onions start turning color, remove the onion and place them on a plate. Then afterwards, I'm going to cook my rice in this microwave rice steamer or you can use a rice cooker or anything that's suitable for you. I'm going to use one and a quarter glass of rice and I'm going to add two glass of water with a bit of salt. Then I'm going to put in the microwave for 15 minutes until my rice is well cooked. And after 15 minutes, my rice is ready. As you can see in the video, it's well cooked. Then 
using an oven dish, add half of the rice at the bottom and spread the fried onions all around. Grated carrots to add a bit of vegetables in the rice and spread the cooked tuna all around the dish. Lastly, add the remaining rice at the top and sprinkle a bit of water as you can see in the video. Lastly, cover the rice with a foil and place it in a preheated oven at 180 degrees Celsius for 30 minutes. And after 30 minutes, our tuna rice is ready as you can see in the video. Mix it very well so that the tuna and the rice can well combine and serve on a plate. And my tasty rice tuna is ready as you can see in the video this is so so tasty you can eat along with a piece of banana and some chili and enjoy your rice tuna thank you for watching my video and hope you loved it and if you want to see other recipes i'll put the links in the description box and if you have any questions you can comment down below or you can follow me on my Instagram for further questions. And thank you once again. Bye-bye.